Looking for apartment complex for sale, California, or income property for sale near me? This short video will give you a little cautionary tale of some California investment property searching I did for a client, and also give you the solution she came up with at the end to actually get you a much higher cap rate in California on your property if it lines up for you. So let's go. This is the investment property that popped up after we had looked at hundreds and hundreds of real property investment options. Um, over time, the MLS was sending us stuff and she and I would look separately trying to find her the right thing. If you've looked in California at all for income property, you'd probably know that the cap rate tends to be about under 5%, meaning on a property that's worth 800,000 at the current valuation levels, the rents coming in the door for that property would be below about below about 4,000 a month. And I picked that example for a reason. So let's take a look at this property that popped up about six months ago that we were so excited to go see when we realized it was a four unit property and each door should rent for about 1100 a month, two bedroom, one bath, bread and butter units. And the pricing was under $400,000. So I checked several things that I always check. I have my spreadsheet of criteria and got my son to hop in the car to go take a look at this thing because it looked like a great deal. Um, the problem was if you look at the numbers, it looked like too good of a deal. So when you go hop in the car to go look at a place without having checked the first three basic things, um, you're possibly gonna waste your time. Now my son and I had a great time and we got some ice cream on the way out and had a lovely drive, but if you are just looking for income property and trying to maximize your time, you don't want to do this. A call to the city and a subsequent email from the city revealed that the zoning on this property was single family residential and they would never allow a four unit property to go forward on that space. So we kept looking. The market ran up and over time, over the past year, we realized she already owned an investment property, a single family home in Los Angeles, and the lot was just big enough to put a second two bedroom home on. The cap rate on that is between eight and 11% with the way that we were looking at it, which is far better than anything else that you could get in California buying with having to pay for the land. One caveat is you probably don't want to, or a lot of people don't want to put an ADU or granny flat on the back of their own home and rent it out and have a tenant running in and out. But if you already own a home as a rental, this might be a good option for you to really ramp up your cap rate. 